This is a 2007 JC24 Tritune Classic. It has 150 horsepower Honda outboard. It's kind of in one of our storage buildings pretty tight. Not sure how soon we're going to get it out, so I thought I'd take a quick video. It's actually, you know, it's the upholstery's got a little bit of wear and tear on it, but generally it's a solid boat overall and runs well. It's going to go down the side here. And that's just dirt. Got a few little paint scratches in the rails. You know, sat in the water. I mean, it's fine, but it does have a calcium buildup on the tubes a little bit. It was always power washed and cleaned every fall, but still gonna have a little bit. It's got a 150 Honda. It's got the extended swim platform. Uh, let's see if I can fit down in there here. Um, I'm move this stuff here. I guess I can see down this side. Yeah, this side's just, it's got a little, little tiny something, probably a pier post or something hit the rail there. Nothing terrible, but it is, it is what it is, I guess, as they say. Let's, uh, back up here. Just moved all that junk off the back. It's got the fold down ladder. This just swings up and it telescope scopes in the swim plat add-on swim platform which is an option Let's see if we can crawl in here it's got the the bimini tops got a beam right there so i can only go so high but it's got a nice it's a brown or tan taupe i guess they call it sunbrella let me see if i can turn on i don't know if i can have my hang on a second okay just figured out how to turn the flashlight on while i'm videoing <laughs> It's got, uh, there's your bimini. That's just bird poop or something. It's in really good shape. Um, it's got the driver's seat, you got the fold up cushion right here. Kind of a booster seat pops up. I just set the windshield up there. We've got it off for storage, but it's, um, Got tilt steering, the hour meter, I think I've got a picture of that on the website. Got a Clarion stereo. It does have a input jack here, so it doesn't have Bluetooth, but you could put an accessory Bluetooth on it easily. It's got a tip out trash can here. You got storage on this side. And it came with an igloo cooler, but I'm sure that's long gone, but uh, has a space you could set a cooler there. You got your front seats up here, both sides. You got the double gates, has an anchor locker in front. Carpet's in good shape. I think they always kept it covered and the cover's in good shape, actually. It's a sunbrella cover. It looks to be in real good shape. Just looking down, I don't see any other than some leaves and stuff. There's no real damage to the carpet anywhere. Sorry if I'm moving around too fast here. Usually down in here is where all the nasty stuff is. That all looks pretty good. It's got a holder for your fenders there. This is the adjustable height table. It's in the down position. You can see how, let's see if I can do this with one hand. You can see how that lifts up. It's sort of hard to do with one hand because I'm holding my phone with the other. So as you can see, I think it's a really nice boat overall. Battery's probably under here. Yeah, there's your battery. Battery lid. But, uh, and on your bimini top, I can see it's got the quick, these are the quick release stainless fittings. So you just have to, this has just a little lever you slide right there. So you've got to put the top up and down a lot. And same thing, the way it attaches on the front. So I just thought this would at least give you an overview since it's not in our showroom where you can see it. Um, just trying to find probably the worst. There's a little bit of texturing you can see. If that comes up just a little bit of texturing on the upholstery but it's uh no tears or anything so be a nice first try tune for somebody oh i just noticed here this also is an option they had these open up you got a little storage compartment there as well all your seats open i didn't think i opened those and you've got rotomolded plastic bases so everything's good there actually let's 
Got the upholstery panel package there. Side doors on both sides. I'm gonna hop out here. Easier to get out here. Sort of a taupe brown package, white on taupe, or taupe on white, however you wanna say that. Um, yeah, that's probably the worst part. A couple of scratches in the rails there. I mean, you can touch that up with white paint if you're trying to make it look really nice, but otherwise that's just a really nice boat. And uh, give us a call if you'd like to discuss this anymore. We appreciate it. Thank you.